No one was inside this SUV found submerged in the Saluda River, but where it was found caused major problems for crews trying to get it out. The first hurdle, trying to get a tow truck up this access road near Holiday Dam. The owner first had to stake out the area without the truck to see if they could make it up there. Then crews tried it, bringing a pickup truck as well, just in case the tow truck got stuck. It was a bumpy ride, but eventually everyone made it to the top, where this red Ford Explorer was found partially submerged in the Saluda River. Divers from the Anderson Fire Department Technical Rescue Team went into the water first. We looked throughout the whole car, made sure no one was in it. We checked uh, seats, floorboard. We, we train on this kind of situation just to make sure we, we clear every inch of the car. There were signs from the beginning that this SUV had been stolen, says Dive Rescue Coordinator Josh Hawkins. When we got to the car, yes, the steering wheel was actually uh, tied in a specific uh, direction. So they had it, had it tied so the car would go in one direction. The team went into the water and attached the winch for James Whittington, owner of James Auto Repair and Towing. This is about the hardest we've ever had. And after a while, the SUV was pulled out, later determined to be stolen out of Lawrence County. How are you going to get back down? Slowly? Very slowly. <laughs> this SUV will now be taken to a storage area, and investigators will then start to try to find the owners. Mandy Gaither, WYFF News 4 in Anderson County.